previously on Project Heat. Dre having something to do with Kiki. Oh, he had something he would do with the line or whatever. So, you know, I just take what I heard, breeze off, right. go holler at murder and let him know what's going on. So now, when Dreeze goes home, I'm hearing that Hollywood chain got that Dreeze in New York. She happened to mention, she said, yo, Pop not mega? Let Pop know that there's somebody in his circle that ain't moving. My name is Lady. Who's that? Who's Lady? It's a woman he's been dating. Dating? Scott's married. What kind of what kind of shit is that? He came to put me on with what's going on with Megan and all that stuff, but he was telling me that Dre got convicted for the body that he tried to blame on my brother. My name came across our desk, Dre's Gray. What's interesting about this case and this guy is that he's been released some time ago. Next thing you know, Scott ends up shot. You just put my job and my freedom on the line. Do you want to replay this whole jail scene again? Wait, Who's going to help us when we're in jail? Nah, you ain't even got to wear it. I'm going to become a Hollywood J shadow from now on. Sound like you a got plan. a shadow. That's what I like. <laughs> Ball game. This is Fuquan Harrison. And now, episode 16. This is Fu Kwan Harrison. Now, if I take these restraints off for of you, I don't want to have a problem out of you, all right? Because we got this, we got this island on lock. We don't want no problems. So can I count on you not causing nothing over here? Can we, can we have that? You heard what she said. Can we have that? Because we got rules over here. So as long as we good, we good. All right? Can I count on you? Let's take these restraints off for a Just remember what I said. I'm gonna take your mask off, okay? Cooperate. <laughs> You're supposed to cooperate. I'm not taking you out this jacket unless you cooperate, okay? One of the most dangerous housing projects in New York City. A single gunshot pierced the night inside this building in the city housing authority's pink houses in East New York. Tears and anguish in East New York tonight after a six-year-old The shooting happened inside the pink houses in East New York in November. I'm from Brook, Brook, Brooklyn, run up on my shit, click, bitch, already knowing how this going in. You know, no way, yeah. <laughs> the bullet, it never lies. Yeah, I need you to see somebody dying. Yeah, I want to remodel this, this whole thing. Here you go. Let me, let, me, let me call you back. Where you been, man? I haven't seen you in a while. You've been avoiding my phone calls? Only reason why I know you're here is because you're secretary. What's this I'm hearing about? You're under investigation for the murder of our brother? And you messing with project girls? I thought you care. What do, you, do you even care about Cooper? He's our brother, he's our family. No, I don't care about you. You were a loser then, like you were a loser now. And the only reason why we were cool is because of Cooper. He was the one that was taking care of you in jail. I wouldn't have gave you a red cent. And now that he's gone, oh, that's dead. So you think that uh, you get out and we, we're supposed to be cool? It's not happening, bro. I'll tell you something, fuck you, fuck mommy, and definitely fuck that. Go fuck yourself. Let's go, Fred. Okay, 
caveman strategy in the building, man. 1165 to be exact. Man, that was tough. I ain't scared of this. Yo, you that you that dude you that dude named Fool? Yo, you the one I gave away all that time from up north? Listen, I'm caveman side too. At the end of the day, I'm in here cause of pop. No word. Word. He told me, when I see you, to give you his number. He need to holler at you. No word. Send that. Word. Huh. You good. Uh, so, um, yo, what house they got you in? I got a package for you. Looking for friends, I see. <laughs> Your man Bells, right? You screaming about? You screaming for? Shut up. Uh, Quiet. You know how these hands I work. I finished with you. I got you. You know how these hands work. I'm like, right, I'm like. You know how these hands work. You don't want no problems. I'm like, clown. I'm gonna bring you on my side of town. Whatever. I ain't finished. I got a lot of things to do with you. Yo. P O P, man. What's hey. good, yo? Yo, we wow. still alive, man. I know, man. Yo, you see what he had, man. Yo, yo, we gotta be on point. Like when you said we need bigger guns, yeah, we need bigger guns. I hope you're working on that, man. Yo, oh, I gotta connect already. Oh, we need to get on that ASAP, man. Already. But you know, soon after I, you know, spit it, we, we spit away. Uh -huh. I went to see my sister, man, and she told me some situation like I gotta, I gotta help her. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah, she what's caught, good? She caught, she caught a man down. You know what I'm saying? Oh. So, I don't know, I'm gonna get the more details on that, but it's one thing I gotta tell you too. Uh-huh. I just got wind of somebody being a snake in my circle. You get what I'm saying? This Dre kind of thing again? Not man. even Dre, because Dre, Dre, Dre is already um, state property. Oh, okay. You wouldn't believe who I found out that the snake. Who? Toya. See? And she be bugging on me all the time because she see that I be there, ready to hold you down, watching you, paying attention to everything, and I don't think she like it, man. That's why I'm telling you, man. See, it's probably her, man. How soon as she left, we had a bang up. Soon as she left. Soon as she left, we had a bang up. Mm. She wasn't even gone two minutes. She ain't had no shots, no nothing. That's kind of crazy to me, man. That's why it's better to have a man hold you down than a woman. They too emotional. Yo, D. You got a point there. And that's why I'm definitely gonna keep my eye on her. You too. Mm -hmm. Keep your eye on her. Don't worry about it, man. I got you, man. You already know, man. Anything, I got you. I'm there, man. I done proved it more than once, man. I'm there, man. I ain't gonna keep telling you that, man. Just, just don't let nobody break our bond. My bond is with you. I know you got your crew, your family, or whatever, but my bond is with you. Don't let nobody get in the middle of that. I got you, man. So, yo, let me go take care of some B.I.D. Count on you, bro. Don't worry about it, man. Let me get up in here. I'm going to holler back at you, man. Right. Phone call away, man. All right. All right. Lady, how are you? Oh, listen, I spoke to your brother Pop, and he told me something that I couldn't even believe. But I'm like, you know your brother, his head all up in the clouds. So I'm like, let me come talk to you, and you can clear it up. What's going on? Like, you know, I was messing with the dude, Scott. Management of the projects. Oh, paid for my brother's funeral. Right, remember him? Mm -hmm. Okay. We've been messing around, you know what I'm saying? Everything was going good with us. One day I'm in his crib, and his brother was, came over. Now his brother's a big dude, you know what I'm saying? But the brother came in the house, he was real chatty, sis. Like chatting, like he knew me. Mm -hmm. Oh, projects, bird, chirping. I'm looking at him like, yeah, all right, whatever. So of course, Scott is gonna defend me, right. you know what I'm saying? So they get to tussling, 
I'm like, oh, you know, I don't want to see Scott get beat up or whatever. I run in the kitchen. I get the pot. I hit the nigga over the head with the pot. Yo, since he fell and all the floor was foam out of From you hitting him with a pot? Are you kidding me? Yo, sis. I have no idea after that, like, really what happened. I was, like, frozen. I didn't understand how this man died. He was dead. That's crazy, yo. Listen. You know, me and you, we grew up together. And when your brother told me that, I couldn't believe it. I'm like, that's not lady. You, that's not That's not lady. That's not even my style. You know I'm not even that type of person. I thought I was entering into a whole different type of thing. He was a manager. You know, he had a job. Not like Dio and all these street dudes that right. pop me with. You know what I'm saying? But every time I'm caught in the mix, I never know what's going on. Right. Nobody tell ladies nothing until I'm in the hospital somewhere. You know what I'm saying? It's just crazy. Then on top of that, I come home and I got eviction notice on my door. Now you know all this time I've been laid up in the hospital, whatever. I ain't been getting no money. Right. Stop been taking care of my bills. He been taking care of the house, whatever. Now all of a sudden I gotta go to court for eviction notice. I get to court, I come out the courthouse. And it's some D's waiting there for me. Right. D's is standing there. They like, yo, you coming with me, my name, my last name. I'm like, okay. Right. I get in there, they questioning me about the brother. Yo, sis, they asking me questions. I don't, you know, I'm so cool with it. I'm just like, you know, like they bugging. So what Scott had to say about it? He calls me, he comes over, whatever, we talking. I'm like, you better fix this. Right. Like, I don't really have nothing else to say at that end. This is my life on the line. I'm not no murderer, Toya. What I'm gonna do if I gotta go to jail? I didn't tell nobody. I didn't know what to do, but something, something gotta give. Now his wife is in the mix. His oh, wife? I ain't even tell you he married. Whoever she is, Whatever she do and whatever she know about me because Jax wasn't coming to my house for my rent, right? Something got to give, sis. I'm tired. Yo. I'm tired of being a victim. I'm tired. I'm tired. Something got to give. You know what you really need to do? I'm going to keep it 100 with you. You need to go to counseling because you remember when you and Keisha got shot, the way it messed me up? I had to go to counseling. I had to go to therapy. That's why I'm the way I am now. That's how I met the chick Candace. While I was up there in therapy. You need you need that. Because I didn't want no parts of these streets either. But when I went in there, it made me the person who I am now. I just came out here on some whole different other. You know what I mean? You got to... I think that's what you need to do. Look into that. Look into that, sis. Just let me know what I got to do. But on the other hand, sis... Something gotta happen with this stop. But I'ma tell happen. you exactly what's gonna happen. Me and Pop gonna murder his ass. No, me, you and Pop is gonna murder that ass. But let's make it happen. Let's do it. Mr. Washington, how are you? First of all, thank you for meeting with us. Of course you know me, Officer White. Detective Boyd, Detective Crew. Is this going to take long? It should. It'll take as long as we need it to take. We're here to help you. You know. First of all, the reason why you're here, Mr. Washington, the reason why you're here, surrounding the murder of your brother. What about it? We just want to ask you a few questions. Uh, during our investigation, we just happened to notice that um, your phone was pinged off the same tower as your brother was last seen in that we know. Um, can you explain that to me? What does all? that have to do with the murder of my brother? Pinging of our phones. Well, that, well, you tell me. I mean, what was what was you doing there at the time? I own a building. Me and my brother own the building. Oh, yeah? That's correct. So what were you doing there at the same time as your brother? We were just handling business just in the building. Business. What it, what? I'm, just, I'm, just, I'm just curious. Um, I just want to know, could that business have led to anything that has to do with his murder? Last we know, he was there. Now you're telling me you were there. So that verifies the reason why your phone ping over there. I mean, could you have been in any dispute with him over the business that you guys were why talking about? Why would there about? be any dispute over business? That's that's why I'm here. I'm asking. We we, we could own you guys same, have gotten anything? We own the same properties. We own the same properties. Yeah. So there's never a dispute about no money. Never at all. Never. Could you guys have got a disagreement? You know, 
something that ended up happening? You guys got in a fight just or told anything? You no. So get to the point. This this is the point. We're trying to get to the point. I'm here to help you. I mean, just you know, don't get too hostile. Come on your side. But I need you to help me. I need you to work with me. The more you work with me, the better it is for you. You can clear yourself, or you can be a suspect. It's your choice. But it's up to you. It's up to you. So you think about it, and let me know which angle you want to take this. Because it's obvious that you were there. Listen, without it's legal obvious that your brother. Without legal was representation, I'm not answering anything. Because from what, from my knowledge, right here, what you're trying to do is you're trying to make me an accomplice to a murder that I didn't commit. So anybody else have any questions? The cops? You have any questions? So, uh, who is Patricia Lady Bowen to you? What do you mean to me? Like somebody personal in my life? Because, be uh, clear. that same night, you know, you and your brother was in the building. The phone was pinged off each other. I keep talking about this phone thing. She's a, she's Look, a tenant I just asked you a simple question. She's a tenant in my building. Then we getting somewhere. But who is she to you? What's the what's the question you're Besides asking? Besides a tenant to the building, to bring you in that building, I just can't see a, a guy like you walking into that building. I know you own it and everything, but I just can't see it. I just want to know what do you and lady have going on? It's none of your business. She's a tenant in my building. That's the only business we have. Come on, man. Is she a jump off? Come on. You can tell me. Next I, question. I got please. some of those myself. Do you have any questions for me? Because this, this is some bullshit. I'm just trying to figure out why you a little. You're not really helping us out. We just want to solve it. Because you're not asking me the right question. I got a question for you. Did you murder your brother? What kind of question is that? Question? Because. You guys split everything 50-50, right? That's correct. So now you get rid of him, you get to keep all the profits for yourself. So now you got lady, you take on a nice little vacation. Mm -hmm. Or maybe you owe somebody else money. The IRS. Do you owe back taxes? Do your homework. I'm clean as a whistle. So you're clean, huh? Well, I'm not convinced. Because if that was my brother, I think I'd be acting totally different from the man that's sitting in this seat. So as it looks now to me, you look like a guilty man. Now if we want to clear this all up right now, I can do something to help you. Like I said, I'm here to help you. You can confess to the murder. I'll talk to the DA, make sure everything is taken care of, make sure everything can go your way as best as we can. We can clear this all up. You can go ahead with your rich life once it's said and done. How about that? Does that sound good? What I look like to confessing to a murder that I didn't commit? And why would I kill my brother in the first place? Well, that's what we had to figure out. You tell I, me. I thought we was here to solve the murder of my brother, not make me an accomplice. Well, that's up to you, Mr. Washington. Your wife. Forget it, man. Look at this guy. He say he owns all these buildings, mm -hmm. right? Bitch, man. But he goes to this shitty building. Mm -hmm. Pardon my language. Mm -hmm. This right? dirty building. Piss all over the hallways, dirty women. He like dirty women, I guess. Cause I know if I was rich, I'd be having me a Kardashian or something, something. right? So now he's in there. I, I never saw an owner come to the building they own. They usually have people do that check up for them and stuff like that, right? And he goes in this dirty building this guy's a slumlord. Y'all can't ever yeah, tell me. Calm life. down, Mr. Washington. You know what the fuck I am? A murderer. Cheetah. Look like a liar to me. I own 55 buildings. And? I'm rich. And? I don't need to kill nobody. I have money out the ass. Money's also a motive. Think about that. I don't care what you say, man. I don't, need to, I don't need to commit no crimes. You hear what I'm saying? I got yachts, I got planes, I got all kinds of stuff. Maybe we all should go on a trip. Maybe you should get a suit, maybe I'll get you a suit. You look like you need one. And you need to go on a boat since you like fishing. Listen, I'm not answering none, no more of your questions unless I have legal, legal representation. But another thing, you know who my wife is? 
Who's your wife, Mr. Washington? Who could that possibly be? I don't care. Why do we care? Maxine Fisher Washington. Maxine So if y'all knew that, I wouldn't be sitting right here. So you know what? I'm gonna excuse myself. Cause you're a bunch of fucking clowns. Thank you as well, Mr. Washington. But we'll be talking to you soon. Why did we have him here without See, knowing this information? This is your job. We pulled him in here. And I wasn't even thinking Washington, Washington just didn't even... I didn't know she was mad. Call her wife. Call her. Oh my. Maybe she can help us out. Freaking goodness. Shit. Washington. Oh. Yo, what's good with you, bro? How you doing? How you doing? Chilling? I'm good. Where you been at? Listen, I just came home and all that. Just came home? Listen, hold on. Where Jay at? Right now? I'm not dealing with Jay right now, bro. He acting kind of different, bro. So if you need anything, holla at me. You heard? Listen. On top of that, your man Suge is still inside right now. What he getting knocked for? They found his prints. You feel me? The last rundown we did, they got his prints and all that. Word. Word the my rundown mother. for the daggone witness, bro? That's a fact, man. Wow, it's hot on Hollywood side for us right now, man. That's what I'm saying. So how you get out? Listen, I got shot. You got they, shot? That's a fact. They can't keep me in there. I'm the one that got shot, dude. Shot by who? How you get shot, I got bro? shot by Hollywood Black. Where? We was over there. Me and my McDonald's and all that. I see him and Pop tussling and wrestling with the gun and all that. On some wild cowboy? Shh. On some wild cowboys. And they shot me and all that. Facts. You know what? Facts. I know exactly what to do about Hollywood Black. You said he's in the, you said the homie is in the spot? Fact, I'm gonna send a kite to the spot. We're gonna take care of Hollywood Black. What I need you to do is stay quiet, bro. You feel me? Make sure you don't talk to nobody about nothing. You talk to somebody, you talk to me. Gotcha. Say that. Hollywood. Hollywood. Huh? Okay. okay. Yo, what's up, what's up with you? you? Chillin', how you been? I ain't seen you in a minute, what's up? How you been? I've been chillin', what's up with your friend Iris? You, you been in touch with her, you seen her? I ain't talked to her in a minute. I ain't talked to her in like three weeks. You know she career driven now. Three she weeks working. though? But three weeks ain't that much work in the world. She got a whole family, we been married for two years, you understand that? We been married for two years. I separated, I'll be in the studio, but I still got time for my family. I stand right. on my principles. I feel you. You can't feel me. How would you feel if you was married to somebody for two years? And in and out, they in and out. You can barely see them. You see them whenever they pop up. How would you feel? I'm going to feel crazy, honestly. I'm going to probably feel like they cheating, but... You might feel like they cheating? All right, so let's just make it... Let's, let's just hope that you see her before I do. So when I went to go make a pickup for Pop, Monster backs out on me on his block. What? Then after that, Pop and Toya blow up his trap house. No. Long story short, he goes to pink houses, start trying to kill Pop, AR-15, up. Pop, what up, baby? What's good, What's up? Pop? Why are you looking like that? I don't know what happened. Yeah? Just telling her about the monster situation and all that. That's the first problem. We got more problems added to the list. You know nah, that, right? We don't need no more problems, Pop. Well, this is reality, and we gotta deal with it. Y'all know a guy named Fuquan? You heard of Fuquan? Who's Fuquan? Okay, I'm gonna tell you who he is, okay? Wait. The guy from back in the days that caught all those bodies? Exactly. He know who he is. This guy is dangerous and notorious, okay? I don't know if he's gonna come home and try to take over what he had or he's gonna fall in pocket. But we definitely gotta check his temperature, okay? Because I'm not letting nobody come to Caveman's side and take over what I put too much blood, sweat, and tears into. Right. Okay? That's the first problem. Now, I have another connect, right? I want you, Murder, to be my pickup guy. We no longer dealing with drugs, okay? This is something that's gonna be undetected. And it's gonna be in, I got 15 
corner bodega stores, right? And like I said, I want you to be my um, my pickup guy. So when you go in these bodegas, you're gonna say this certain word so they know that you're there for me. Say poncho, okay? Poncho. When they when you say poncho, they're gonna give you a bag. You take that bag, murder, and you come straight to me. No cutting left, no cutting right. Don't even go get a haircut. Don't go get no new sneakers or nothing. What's in the bag? The less you know, the better you're off, okay? No haircut, no sneakers. You wildin', Pop. Yes, Myrtle, because you are easy to get distracted. I want you to stay focused, okay? So with that being said, I, you know, I summed everything. Oh, wait, 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 hold on. There's one more thing, man. What's up now, man? My rider, man. I don't want to believe this, but I went to see Mega, right? And he's telling me that his girl told him that I still have a snake in my circle. And it's not Dre, because Dre belongs to state property right now. Here we go again. Real talk. And y'all want to know who he said that the snake is? Who? Toya. Nah. Sis? That's ridiculous, Bob. Nah. I'm dead serious. Now, it's coming to me. So, I'm putting y'all on. Y'all better keep your eyes on. If she moving funny, y'all let me know, okay? I heard enough, Pop. Yeah. I, I'm not hearing that. I'm gonna go do a drive. I'll get up with you, man. Later. Let me talk to you, Bob. What's up? We cool, right? Yeah. I'm your little sis. Yeah. I hold you down. You hold me down, right? Candace, why are you coming? Yeah, what's up? What point you trying to get at, man? Because you're coming at me funny. I feel like you're forgetting about Butterball, Selwyn, and us breaking you out of jail. No, I'm not. What? Why? What's up? Pop, I feel like you put me in a category with Toya right now. You said she a snake, right? Wait, 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 hold on. Let me break something down to you, all right? If I was putting you in a category like Toya, I wouldn't be telling you to watch out for her. I'd be watching out for you, okay? The reason why I'm acting like this towards you is because that last situation with them Hollywood dudes that took me by storm, Candace. Because you want to move careless, and that could have cost my life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hear you, Pop. But I could pick up a gun for you, but I can't do pickups. I can't meet the connect. I can't go to the bodegas. But you got murder doing everything, right? You got to remember, Pop. I'm a setup girl. I'm a pretty girl. They would never expect me to do the things I'm doing for you. Remember that. Yo, fam. Yo, Sam, let me ask you something, man. Last time I seen you, man, you was my Hollywood Black. Where you at? I don't know. What's me? I don't know. Ain't your man? I'm cool with everybody. Everybody like who? Everybody. Cool from fellas from Hollywood, cool niggas from everywhere. But I'm from Farrah. I ain't got nothing to do with none of this. I'm just trying to do my time. All right. You know what I'm saying? I mean, if I had something to do with it, you know what I mean? When you was getting it popping with TV, boom. I just spent it up. I could have got involved. You know what I mean? I'm just neutral. I'm just trying to do my time and get out of here. Man. All right. You sure about that? I'm positive. All right, man. Huh? Be cool, man. I'm off this. All right. What up, how you doing? Good, bro. What's I mean, good with you? Looking good, man. I appreciate I'm that. Appreciate that. I'm glad you're here. I'm gonna tell you the truth, though. I got something to tell you. Let's talk about it then. Officer Iris Santiago. It's always good to see you on this side of the table. 
By the way, you've been doing an amazing job with all this that's going on. And we appreciate all the hard work that you're doing, all the dedication. But I need to know what's going on on the inside. We need to get to the bottom of this, these open cases that we have. And I just need you to fill me in, give me an update on everything that's going on with you. Yes, Officer White. I have some very important information for you. Hmm. Let me pull it out. Turn it down on me. Let me hear it. Okay. The Marquez brothers mm -hmm. is not the big fish anymore. So who's the big fish now? There's a division. Pop and Toya mm -hmm. are warring with Monster. Mm, interesting. Monster killed G Marquez. Wow. Um, so where do we go from here? If, 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 uh... Listen. Pop doesn't trust Toya anymore. Someone told Pop there was a leak in his camp, and now I'm scared for my life. But I understand. But this is what I need you to do. Officer Santiago, what I need from you, first of all, I need you to calm down. I need you to stay focused. And like I told you before, you are doing an amazing job at what you're doing. And I feel it's almost getting to the end. All right, but you need to stay focused. We close this stuff on now. All right, we're with you every step of the way. But okay. I'm in too deep this case, Officer White. It's I understand that. We didn't mean for it to go this far. I'm Wait. jeopardizing my marriage, my livelihood. I haven't been home in God knows how long. I understand. Whenever you feel you need to exit, back on out. And we'll take it from the top. The quicker we can wrap this up, the quicker you'll have your life back. Okay, yeah, everything will be back to normal. And before you know it, you'll get exactly what you want. Most of all, you get exactly what you deserve. And that's getting up to that detective status. I don't want to exit yet. I'm getting closer to pop. Stay focused. Can I get that from you? Yes, you can. All right. I appreciate everything you're doing for us, all right? All right. We got you. Three step of the way. Remember that. All right, let's focus on you now. sure you got my back? I got your back. Don't really worry about that. Okay. Okay. You got this. All right. This. Appreciate it. Good job, all right? Thank you. Queens alone, man, you know, come out here, set up shop, you know. Alright, alright. Keep yourself out of trouble though, Pop? Yeah, man, it's good to see you though, man. It's been nah, a long man. time, man. I'm on some straight Joe shit, Pop, keeping oh, it clean. Man, don't tell me that you going to jail and scared you, man. Nah, I ain't trying to go back. That's what it is. You know, that's a good way of thinking, man. You know, yeah, no doubt. For me, I'm trying to, you know, dibble dabble in these streets. What's going on out here though? It's, it's cool. It's cool. Alright, I'm nothing major. Alright. You want to show? Yeah, I'm good. Alright, that's what it is. This, this my money man, okay. son. Yo, hey, hold on, hold on. Hey, yo, Al, what's up, boy? Oh, you in building two? Okay, okay. Oh, you got D with you? Okay, so, okay, so I'm on my way right now. Right now. All right. Steve, look, I know you just came home and you can't, but listen, matter of fact, come walk me on that side real quick. Yo, Pop, we ain't going to get into that, right, kid? Yo, yo, Steve, you good, man. Trust me, you safe with me, man. Come on. All right. Yeah, I'm driving away. I see monster. I said, hey,
One of the most dangerous housing projects in New York City. A single gunshot pierced the night inside this building in the city housing authority's pink houses in East New York. Tears and anguish in East New York tonight after a six-year-old... The shooting happened inside the pink houses in East New York in November. I'm from Brook, Brook, Brooklyn, run up on my shit, click, bitch, already knowing how this gonna end. Oh, yeah.